Hi guys, and today I'll show you how to download and use Microsoft's Make Code. So let's get on to the video. So first, you will have to click this where to download, and then there'll be a link to it down below in the description. So remember to click that. And then when you open that link, you will go to this page and just wait for it to load. And, it'll, and then what I'll say is, it should say setting up Make Code for Minecraft. Now, Make Code will only work for Windows 10 or Education Edition, so if you have any of those two, it'll work, but for Java and other editions, it will not work. So right now, let me click on here. And of course, you have to have Minecraft installed. And then step two, it'll say install code connection. Now you just have to click on download code connection, and it'll go to here, and as you can see, it's loading. So after it finished loading, you would just have to click on it and just wait for it to load. And as you see, I'll just say opening it. And then what you have to do is here, I'll open a small page. You just have to click next, and then I'll just install the code connection. And then just click finish. And what you need to do now is you have to search Minecraft. And remember to click the first one, not Java. And you see it's loading right now. So, um, so if you read the instructions here, it'll say first you have to start Minecraft, then then create a world, and then um, with and then when you create a world, remember you have to turn cheats on. If not, then it won't work. And you'll know it works when there's an agent. And then you just have to click create. So let me just wait for Minecraft to load. And then, as you can see, you have to have it logged in, and then you can click play. And then create new. And then create a new world. And you can name anything you want, it doesn't matter. Just I'll just name it Make Code World. And then you can just do any seed, but I would just do creative for now. And then just turn this off. Go down here, and you have to scroll down and see it. I'll say activate cheats. So as you can see, that's turned off. But if it's turned off like this, so if it's gray, they have to turn it on, and then you can use it. And then, and then if you're not sure, you can double check here if you've done all the steps correct. And then as you can see, it has to turn on activate cheats. If not, then this will not work. And then here, you click create. Then of course, you would go into new world as usual. So what next we have to do is if we go back to here, Remember just now we download code connection, so now we have to open it. So it'll say code connection for Minecraft. Double click on that. And then just let it load. And as you see right now we have a new browser that says code connection. Please enter the following command in Minecraft, education edition or Windows, it doesn't matter. So basically all you have to do is click this. And see right here it also says click this. And go back to here, click T and then insert the code in. Let's see, and then you just click this. And as you see, there has been an agent, hello agent. And that means it has connected. So if you scroll down right here, then as you see, it also says here. And the code connection will pop at another window. So just have to go here, as you see back here. If there's a tab right here, then let me just move this down here. So today, we'll, so today I'll just be teaching you how to make chicken rain as of last time. I'm just going to click JavaScript and it's going to start a tutorial. So, so um, as you see right here, it has some instructions. If you just copy those instructions, and then right here, I'll have the first one, which will be it. And then, you add the, and then here it says, so if you want to be swung closer to your head, then of course you could change the pause in the middle but 10 will be fine, so right here. And then it's a run your code, so of course you can run your code right now. And then when you go back right there, you should see it one chicken. Close this again, go back to here. As you can see, it works. So if there's not a chicken above your head, then um, maybe you, you have to try it again, or there's something wrong with your code. So if you go here, then so the chicken is loading, of course. So give a chicken some friends, now you have to add a loop. So what you have to do is click on behind here, click enter. Now will go down one bar right here. And you click four, and you just type in the chat, type in the command. 
for what? I remember you had to um, copy the same amount, so you can't add some random things, like you can't add like an extra space or an extra whatever you want. And you see sometimes it'll pop out some random stuff, so you just have to delete that. Yeah. And type that again, four. Let I remember it. And if you can see there's space on top, so of course you have to add spaces in or it won't work. I let oh and then you put this colon. Ah. Uh, oh and then put this colon again and then right here. Um, you just have to do the I again. And what else? You have to click another space, do this, and click 100, do that colon again, and click I plus plus. So every time there's a chicken, then I'll add one to give our chickens more friends. So this code will just spawn 100, but if you want to spawn more than 100, or like wherever you, whatever amount you want, just have to change that 100 in the middle right here. And then remember to click close that bracket with that special one at the side and then click enter and as you, um, this one does not go in. So what you need to do is you need to copy this, control copy, and you need to control paste it in back again. And then what you need to do is so the code does not get confused, remember you have to delete the bottom part. So make sure that this is the same and then you can make sure that, and then run your code again and see a flock of chickens overhead. And look. Okay, so that's all you need to, to do the chicken code so that you guys can also have your world bombarded by chickens. Look at them. So I can see right now, but if you wanted, if you wanted like the one like us, then you can actually go back to here and you can change this. But remember, if, you're, if your computer is beefy, then it can hold a lot. But if it's only, um, but it will, but it will bring quite a lot of lag if it, it if it gets to one thousand five hundred will also bring some lag. So I think that's the end of the tutorial today. So leave a like and subscribe for more. Bye.